Good morning. Good morning. It is the start of Camp Creator, day number one. Yeah. It is, what, Thursday? Don't know. We got up at <laughs> 5.45 this morning. We've just got to go shopping. And then we're meeting up with Urban Explorers. And then we're off to the shore for 10 o'clock. Quick diesel stop. Don't think it's going to fill it up totally. We're at B. P. I think it's a BP. And you know what the BP prices are? All stocked up, shopping done, dusted, three minutes away from the event venue. Are you excited? Not really. No. <laughs> <laughs> I'll be honest. But I do just want to get there, get the awning up. Yeah. And relax. Stressful morning, isn't it? Yeah. We're well, not used to getting up at this time of morning. I mean, it's still only 10 o'clock, but we had an awful lot to do, didn't we? It's all done now. We can relax very, very soon. Welcome to Camp Creator. Don't know how to get there. Can't get under that tree. We're going to have to go in over there, though. I don't know if it's there or there. Uh, no, I don't think it's there. We've arrived and it's Mr Radford. Morning. Good morning, Mr <laughs> Radford. What's all this you've given us? Check this out. Let's Steve has kindly made these for us. Okay. You, can you explain Steve love. Well this is a Travel Trolls TV QR code. If you scan that it takes you to our YouTube. Should we try that? Yep, try that. Here we go. We're going to hit that up there. Check that out. And it's on our YouTube. Very good. That's Very good. brilliant. Yeah, Thank you Steve. What a little touch. Work. That's really good. Well, well, we have got a printing company. <laughs> <laughs> does help. Oh, no, but that's it personal help. isn't it? it? So it's nice. Wonder let's get you parked up. Yeah, yeah. Up, so, yeah. Someone in Neil, apparently, wherever. Do you know where he is? Follow me. Okay. Yeah. Uh, Steve, Just running by. <laughs> See you later. He's even got his own personalised yellow nice, fur. Yeah. Check him out. <laughs> Thanks, Steve! <laughs> Thank you. Check that little, little motorhome out. This one here. Who belongs to that? Yeah. <laughs> That's well good, isn't it? Yeah. Hello! Can I pull faces like you? I do love this auto trail here. I'm not sure whose it is yet, <laughs> but it's lovely. Right, well, there's the lads, Emma and Neil. <sighs> oh, we better have space for an awning. They're not leaving much That's room, are they? Yeah. yeah. Good morning, you lazy git. Well, I need you to get out of bloody way. <laughs> <laughs> Shouldn't be so small then, should you? I don't want small viewers. <laughs> you do love your stickers, don't you? I love my stickers. This one's going up here. I just hope I've got it straight, Mazzy. Yeah, I don't think I have, have I? Yeah. Is that straight? Uh... Is that straight? Is it there? Yeah, they look straight enough to me. It's a bit to the right, but that's straight. Oh, oh right. it's, right. it's, it's a good. bit to the right. <laughs> that's not straight then. Straight enough. There's two mil Terry over there. <laughs> so we've met up our pitch. We've got sticker. Neil and Ems next door to us. Good morning. Good morning. We've got little wheel, little man in the van over there. And I'm Oz, not sure of anyone Oz, else. Oz, yeah, back to you two. Us. Um, just, just can, and just you. Can we just say, yeah. for, for all your subscribers, yeah. we know Dan and Mazzy, and we do, yeah. but we've spent a few days with them. They are the loveliest people you will ever meet. Literally, <laughs> what you see on camera, and people say it's, oh, YouTube's all fake, it's all made up, it's all scripted. It's not. Dan is literally that stupid in real <laughs> life. Danny is lovely. Danny, Mazzy is lovely. Dazzy? And we've christened them Dazzy. So Thank you. you need to go oh, in the com yeah, like you need that. to go in the comments and do hashtag Dazzy. Dazzy. And of course we've got the lovely Poppy and Dolly. They're just playing. They love each other, don't they? You love each other. <laughs> Now in the last few shows and meetups we've been we've met this lad called Will. I think he was saying he's about 28, 29. He had dreadlocks, you might have seen him in previous videos. And we took him under his wing, we like him. We told you to subscribe, you might remember. Um, and we try, we're giving him a ridge monkey basically. We don't like a ridge monkey. 
No. Which is Will's? Mine's tidy. Oh. <laughs> Will was telling us he's already got one. Yeah. And because you This was going says, in the bin anyway. This was going in the bin. We yeah. don't like the ridge monkey. No. It's cool. So, yeah, you've got a bigger one. I'm going to wash it up for him. Check out oh, Will's fan. I'm going to do a tour on Will's fan this week. We're going to do a proper tour on yeah. this this weekend, yeah. I was yeah. supposed to the last time we saw Will at Stratford, but... Yeah. This is the beauty <laughs> about these uh, meetups. Yeah. You can help each other out, can't yeah. you? Yeah. We're helping Will. Someone's going to help us. Yeah. They'll help Thanks, someone guys. else. Everyone helps each other, and that's what it's all about. <laughs> Check out Will. Oh, no, I'll do that on my tour. Yeah. Do it's all the in tour. the tour. <laughs> yeah. I've just noticed, lives. you know, we wanted to give him something to help him out on his travel. Right. So we gave him. Keep that out. Uh, keep that out. I need to film that in a moment. Okay. And I just noticed under this table was this bag, and I saw all these popping out. <laughs> Look how many pot noodles and dry foods, because they are easy. You know, just boil a kettle, fill them up, and it's food. But you yeah. can't live like that. And then so, we got in this one, we've got the stove and everything. There's a food, okay. We've got lots and lots of stuff in here. Okay. Got kettle, plates, frying pan. Okay. Then I've got doing all right, then? My, uh, my stove in there. You're doing it. We're going to yeah, go through, we're literally going to go through that. everything. We're going to do a yeah. proper review of your van this weekend. Yeah. And this is where he said he keeps his proper food in a cool box under here. And this is what he's calling proper food. I don't know what's in here. Let's have a look. Cheese, bread, cheese, scotch eggs, pizza pocket. This isn't proper food. Oh, yeah, it is. But I'll be honest, this is how I'd live if I was yeah. single. So yeah. I'm not going to knock you. Yeah. <laughs> Those five times a day for a week. They're all drunk. Asking Left me in charge. <laughs> Begging us to take a video down. <laughs> Good morning. So it's day two. It's a little bit dark in here. I'm just going to show you our little setup because there's no electric here. So what we've actually done for the first time ever. Oh, I can't show you. We've actually put the silver screen on, which keeps it lovely and cool in here. So that's nice. What else is our setup? So I've got the total cool, full power, connected down here to the Jackery, connected to a solar panel. So I can have this on all day it, and it's hot it's hot so the lovely rob and lynn are coming today our friends and they're going to struggle they've never really done off grid before no electric as such and i know lynn's been uh, panicking about um keeping cool of an evening so when she gets here we're going to be lending her this for beside her bed alongside with a jackery keep her cool let me take you outside to show our little jackery setup we have got Panels and panels everywhere. And they're keeping well topped up actually, aren't they, babe? Very well. As a matter of fact, we've got too much power, haven't we? Yeah, we actually have. <laughs> yeah. No, it's keeping us fridge going perfectly. Hovering around 90%, very, very happy with us power. So I'll take it to the boot. I'll tell you what these two solar panels and this Jackery's keeping charge is. Or how it's electric fan cooler. And there's actually still ice in there, so that's working. So far we have two stickers, so it's sticker time. Having a bit of sticker trouble, so while I leave Dan to sort that out, I'll just show you our silver screen. Like I said, we've had this silver screen since the day we got the van, and I think we've only actually used it once in Scotland for the cold. We've never used it for the heat. Brilliant, brilliant idea, and obviously this can flap down if you want some light in there, so... Yeah, brilliant. I don't know why really, but we were having a lot of trouble with this one, wandering bird. So, where shall I stick this? Do you know what? I'm going to rip this out and stick it there. I think that'd look nice there. And she had a good selection of stickers because I could have picked any colour I wanted. Next one we have is this. Now I do like this, but I'll be honest, I have no idea who he is. Right, let's get this one on. So with this one, I'm going to just start down here, I think, because it'll fit nicely there. 
we go. Hopefully we'll collect a few more to, uh, over the week. Yeah. I've got one more. I've got one more sticker from the lovely two behind me. Give me away. <laughs> one more sticker. Let's find a lovely perfect place for this. I'm thinking over here or there. Just under there. <laughs> so run down to what exactly happened on day one. Well, not a lot. <laughs> I went to bed in the afternoon for an hour to chill out and relax and recuperate as the sun got to us and then we both actually went to bed quite early last night, believe it or not. We were party poopers, weren't we darling? Party poopers. We <laughs> Top of the world, Neil. Oi, oi. <laughs> I'm on a tie, Sally. I thought you were going to sing the national anthem then. I don't know it. No. <laughs> That's Dan's job. <laughs> This is what me and Dan need, one of these flags. Neil give us the idea. And contacts. Look how tall this thing goes and it's lit up all the way as well. <laughs> Here comes the lovely Steve. Hey. Lovely Steve. You put on such a lot of effort into this show. Thank you, Steve. You're more than welcome. Thanks for coming, man. Thank yeah, you. Yeah, brilliant. Fantastic. Enjoying yourself? Absolutely. Brilliant. That's the main thing. Right, getting away from the show for a minute, we're going to do something different. We are going to do a tour on this lovely fan, which belongs to Hello, Little guys. Man Adventures. Hey, guys. <laughs> <laughs> and if you haven't been over to his channel, please, please go over and support him. He's, your aim is to get 1,000 subscribers by the end of this week. Yeah. Go over and help him out. Let's Thank take a talk you around your little, little fan. Yeah. So let's start with what exactly have you got? What are you driving here? It's a 2008 Citroen Berlingo. Yep. Uh, it's the XTR model, which has got a few tricks up its sleeve compared to a, a another like the uh, normal Berlingos. Right. So um, it's got uh, metal skid plates underneath the engine. Uh, it's got a like a system on it where the uh, Front where the front wheels start slipping, and uh, the back end, the back wheels start turning when the front end starts. Oh, to like slip. Rear, rear, rear wheel drive, is it? Or uh, front wheel drive. I can't remember uh, what it is. It's like a four wheel drive system, but it's not oh, proper see. four wheel drive. I have one thing yeah. I have noticed though: is your tires. Yeah. No, they big are they are tires pretty heavy. on it, <laughs> <laughs> and uh, it's got a thirty mil lift kit on it as well. So yeah, it's it's a pretty cool little van. So this van actually does have a name. Yeah, it's called Billy. Billy the Berlingo! Yeah, named after my uncle who used to own it from brand new. Oh, that's lovely. Yeah. So you've kept it on and... Yeah. And you've done all like the transformation in the back here then? Or? Yeah, yeah. Um, I bought the uh, camper unit uh, second hand for £110, I think it was. Yeah. But brand new, uh, with the cushions, it would have cost £400. Right. Now, but, you don't actually live in this, do no, you? But no. But you do practically live in it, because you're always, <laughs> yeah. always away. I'm always out in it. I right. spend most of my time out in it, yeah. Right, let's start with the cab. So there's not a lot to show in the cab, is there, Will? It's just the normal no. average cab. Yeah, it's all good in there. I changed the stereo. Oh, you changed the stereo. Yeah, He's also a got a um, solar, solar panel. panel to help him with his electrical yeah. needs. Where would you want to start? In the back or in the side? Um, could start in the side, Let's yeah. start in the side. Now, this is pretty hippie-ish, isn't it? I like yeah. this. <laughs> yeah. I really like this. So this is my uh, van in bed mode at the moment. Yeah, this is bed mode. You see the jackery there? Somebody, yeah, that's my power. <laughs> somebody kindly gave him that, which actually we did have one for him, but we found out he's got one. And that la would last, Will, a week or two. Yeah, so he doesn't it lasts need me to. for ages. Yeah. So this is bed mode. I will yep. say one thing, when I was in there just now, oh, that's hot, Will. That's is hot. It? Yeah. <laughs> but I suppose you can have the back open yeah. as well, can't yeah. you? And, uh, Underneath, I got in the footwell. Yeah. I got my water. Water storage. Got my bin there, my rubbish, and then at the end, I got my cool box. Right. And you actually still got quite a lot more space in there, haven't yeah. you? Yeah. And then my little table. Oh, that's lives, cute. Lives oh, in like there that. as well. Lives in that spot. Yeah. And then in the back, we can open up. 
we've got even more storage. Uh, oh yeah, this is all your storage in my ideas. Under here, I've got my dry food. Dry food. Um, and then in this one, I've got my cutlery, plates, all your essentials. pots and pans, and my gas stove in that one. And who built this, Will? Did you actually build this frame kind of work? No, um, I bought it second hand. Oh, you bought it? I oh, bought I see. It, yeah. Yep. But, uh, Let's just yeah. have a peek under here, look. Yeah, my so bed. Is, so this is quite cool, because you could have all your doors open if you were a wild camp here. Yeah, And yeah. you could just lay under the stars, so to say. Yeah. Oh, look, it's he's really got the Pringles cool. beside him. Yeah. Good man. Yeah, all my stuff lives next to me. <laughs> <laughs> and that's a huge bed, actually. Yeah, and uh, you can actually sleep up to six foot with this uh, layout. Yeah. The uh, front seats fold completely flat oh. and it extends the whole length of the van oh, so two, two people up to six foot can sleep in this so Dan the would whole be all right in the there van. then wouldn't he and then <laughs> yeah in this side in the bottom oh this side opens too yeah there's my cool box yeah with all my cool food and everything like that which i like that because that's quite yeah. slimline yeah that's a good idea i like and that then, also turns into a little seating area with a table. Yeah, which I'll we're going to confirm in one minute. Let me just show you all his stickers that he's proud to have. Yeah, aren't got you? Got loads of stickers. You got some this weekend. Oh, there's Wheels Channel. Let if you can. If you, oh, I don't know if you're going to be able to see. Click on that little man adventures. There you go. And we've got more stickers at the back actually. Yeah. More and actually, you only on got. You'd only actually gotten one from us yesterday, didn't you? Yeah, that's on the other side of the window. There you go. I'm yeah. sure by the end of the week. Where's our one? Where's our one? <laughs> <laughs> Yay! Oh, that one's falling down. So this van is perfect for little little man in a van. Because yeah. if you see the height difference, look, I'm five foot one, what are you? I'm five foot one as well. No way! Yeah. Well, and I must be five, on the tall five one. Yeah. <laughs> right, yeah. so what Will's going to do now, he's going to convert it and show you his daytime setup. Yep. Right, we're going to watch you do this, because I want to know how quick yeah. you can do this. <laughs> are you, are you, you've got to be an expert at it. <laughs> it takes me a little while. Man in a van, isn't yeah. it? Yeah, and uh, the fa my favourite spot to park up is at a beach, so I have this nice view from my little table. It's perfect for the beach. Yeah. Now the thing is, Will is actually going to be getting Liam the Terrible, who does fan conversions, who also has another channel. Go over and subscribe to him too. And yeah. he's actually going to be helping you to improve this yeah. in September. So I'll have to come back it, it's and do in an update. November. Oh, November. Yeah, November. I'm, I'm booked in to have it done. So I'm going to yeah. definitely have to come back and do an update on your fan. Yeah, I we? can't wait. Happy holidays. Happy holidays. It's bloody warm, is it? It's hot, hot. Robin Lynn on tour, The lovely Robin Lynn. <laughs> well, I'm lovely. I don't know about the old bird. Quickly spoken to the lovely Lynn and Rob. They've actually got fan problems of their own at the minute. So, <laughs> but um, they've kindly brought me up these today. My new sugar and coffee and bread bin. I think there's another one actually. There sure is. Dan's just come in and he's like, "What are these? Where are many people and these?" Tash from Love Your Bricks is like, "I'd never get away with that." I said I usually wouldn't normally, but Lynn kindly has brought them up for me. So I'm going to place these somewhere now. I think what I'm going to do is get rid, maybe not get rid of it as such, but take that out and put my bread bin there. We never have anywhere to put our bread. As you can see, all the bread on the worked up actually. Loving this already. Look, a whole pack of rolls. This is brilliant. But what I have kind of decided is I don't drink tea or buy tea, so I'm not going to need that one. Coffee, I do usually leave it in the jar, but I'm gonna see if I can get that in my drawer, and this is gonna be perfect. I love it, I love it. So I'm placing my new bread bin there. Tea caddy, I don't need that. And there is my sugar and coffee. Do you like it? I love it. Oh. 
It's a girls' thing. You're not interested, are you? No. So we've just met the Yorkshire Roamers. Yorkshire Motorhome. No, no, because they changed their name, didn't they? The Mo Yorkshire. I can't speak. It's on the sticker, Maz. It's on the sticker. It's on the sticker. Yorkshire Motorhomers. You know what's so cool and special about the Yorkshire Motorhomers? They're lovely people. They're from Yorkshire. Yeah. And the last name is the same as mine. Right. Holdsworth. Where would you like this, my dear? Uh, can we have it on a sticker wall? Should we have it somewhere no, up here I don't and come want, down? No, I don't want it no. uh, bent. You're putting it on bent. But should we come down no, now? No, I think it's too thick. I think it needs to come down here. Yeah? No. No. Closer. Closer. No, maybe here. Yeah, put it over there. Go right up to Van. That's it. Beautiful. Beautiful. Welcome to the club. This is growing fast, Mazzy. <laughs> it is. So Rob and Lynn on tour have arrived. In their beautiful van. But they've got problems. They had a habitation check yesterday. Um, and apparently they've not done a good job of the pipes. So I've come to offer me help. Rob, do you yeah. need any uh, gorilla tape? <laughs> I think we've got an abundance of gorilla tape. <laughs> I'm good. Are you? Well, I'm not going to ask you if you. No. <laughs> so yeah, the habitation check didn't go too well. I'm sure we're going to get it sorted. There's 70 vans on here. Everyone's willing to help, but only one person's turned up. See you later. <laughs> Dan's loving this. More stickers to the collection. Who we got today? Manchester Van Life, Arkid, and I just love that. Just show them van. Yeah. The van. <laughs> it's gorgeous. I love the old. What do you call this? Graphics? What do you call it? Graphics? Yeah. Art? It it's brilliant. It's, it's kind brilliant. of camouflagey, but look look at the best bit on there. Look. There you go. <laughs> <laughs> You're going to lose subscribers now. <laughs> well, you all know Dan loves his stickers. <laughs> Manchester Arkid, fan life. Excellent. Super duper. And this is his friend, the kayak dread girl. Kayak dread, yeah, and her hair is amazing. It's gorgeous. You might have guessed, she's got dreadlocks. <laughs> and I've been watching a few of their videos lately and watching them in the last 24 hours, and they seem to love basking in the sun. <laughs> <laughs> I think we should put them together, don't yeah, you? Yeah, put them together. Together forever. <laughs> Brilliant. There we go. Loving it. Our lovely friends have just come back from shopping. We didn't buy any alcohol at all. No, hide that, yet. Yeah. But, look what they've brought in us. I thought he was joking to start with. <laughs> We've got a lottery ticket, babe. We hope you win. <laughs> We've got one each. What number? So if mine wins, I'm out of here. If you win... Just throw them in, Ben. There's not what? a single number nine on any of them. No, what a lovely gift. Emma and Neil has bought on us. There you go, you can check our lottery tickets and see if we've won. That's a party. Oi, oi. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> just taking you all down. Just taking you down to see the lovely Rob that hasn't been doing? stressed today. How you doing? Is it all sorted? Well, we've just bunged the hole up because there's nothing else we can do. Right, okay. So I've been under there sweating like a pig. I'm filthy. But I've, well, with the help of these people, I've done it. We have done it. We need to give them a quick update, Mazzy, on the dog. We do. The dog, we, what we found. Yes. Um, we took the dog to reception and he came back about four hours later, didn't he? Yes. Saying um it found the owner the owner was it was actually it run away from a cottage over like two fields away from the campsite apparently they have five dogs and they keep running away apparently it, it happens all the time her dogs still go up to there but yeah so that's nice so it? he's got his happy owner. story and it was a boy wasn't it a girl was a boy, yes. so calling him charlie was a good idea yeah <laughs> so he's all right right anyway we're gonna, gonna end this video now how can we end it mazzy we need some kind of good let's nick steve radford's idea Brilliant idea. Shall we say goodbye? Goodbye. Goodbye. Good night! Good night!
Happy holidays! <laughs> Happy holidays from Robin Lynn on tour and good night. 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 Hey, Good night. Good night. Good night. God bless. Good night. Good night. Good night. Good night, guys. Good night, guys. Good night. Good night. Good night. Good night. Buenos noches from the van. Good night. Bye. Bye. Good night, Irene. Good night. Good night, everybody. Goodbye. Goodbye. <laughs> night, night, Lindsay. Goodbye. Farewell. I'll be just say goodbye. Goodbye. <laughs> See you later. Bye. Until next time. <laughs> Bye. Bye! It's been fun! Say goodnight! <laughs> Night! Goodnight! See you later! <laughs>